Hi, this is Joe Luca. I'm president of the Rhode Island Association of Realtors, and I wanted to give you the market update from the National Association of Realtors for the month of February 2018. Existing home sales and price growth are forecast to moderate, primarily because of the new tax law's expected impact in high-cost housing markets. So while many of the houses in my home area in the state of Rhode Island are not impacted by the tax law, in an adverse manner. Many of the higher end ones are, and if you're in parts of the country that have lots of those houses, that's going to definitely impact them. Pending home sales were up slightly in December for the third consecutive month, and in 2018, existing home sales and price growth are forecast to moderate, again, primarily because of the new tax laws, potential impact in high cost markets. Uh, the index right now is about 0.5% above a year ago. Lawrence Young, the National Association of Realtors Chief Economist, uh, he says another month of modest increases in contract activity is evidence that the housing market has a small trace of momentum at the start of 2018. Now, some markets were impacted by uh, snowstorms and adverse weather, so perhaps that may have hurt them. Uh, jobs are plentiful. Wages are finally climbing after more than 10 years. That's real wages. And the prospect of higher mortgage rates are perhaps encouraging more aspiring buyers to really begin their search now. Uh, these are positive indicators that may not lead to a, a stronger sales pace, but, you know, they are still positive. Uh, buyers throughout the country continue to be hamstrung by record low levels of supply. Uh, in Rhode Island, we only have 2.8 months, and that's pushing up prices, uh, especially at the lower end of the market. So it makes it harder for that entry-level buyer, which in the state of Rhode Island is about that you know, $120,000 to $150,000 buyer. Um, uninterrupted supply and demand imbalances throughout the country fueled appreciation to 5.8% in 2017, which was the sixth straight, sixth straight year of gains above 5%. So things are really starting to uh, come back. Tight inventories are expected to put upward pressure on prices most of 2018, and Dr. Yoon expects overall price growth to shrink a little bit, with some states perhaps experiencing a decline. Again, this is national perspective. And this is because of the negative effect, uh, changes in mortgage interest rates, the mortgage interest deduction, and state and local deductions under the new tax law. So they could all be potentially tough. Um, so, yeah, things, while we're not overly optimistic, we are cautiously optimistic that things are going to remain strong, and that is in face of rising interest rates and the change in the tax law, we still think, think things are going to be strong. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me, 401-580-9797, or you can text me at that number. My email, josephluca at remax.net. Thank you very much.